uh, no doubt about it. I think last month we had over 302,000 individuals. When you get 10, 12,000 people uh, a day coming to the border, we have a humanitarian crisis. And again, you know, the president, if I was advising the president, I would say, hey, address the American public. Tell them that there is a humanitarian crisis at the border that you're going to get on it. You're going to come up with something to address it. It's it's not only the money part of it, but we do need to make some policy. The out of control border crisis with tensions running high at makeshift migrant shelters. One fight even took a deadly turn over the weekend. The New York Post describing those migrant tent cities as helter shelter for good reason. Alexis McAdams is live from Rambles Island in New York City. Good morning, Alexis. Hey, Dana, yeah, a lot of things unfolded over the weekend with the migrant crisis here in New York City. We can tell you one migrant here in Randall's Island was stabbed at least one time in his torso. He was rushed to a local hospital, but he didn't make it. Take a look on your screen. This is where it all unfolded here in Randall's Island on Saturday night, just after 7 o'clock there, happening right outside of that migrant shelter. And remember, Dana, these were... It's cold in Las Vegas, very, very cold. It's going to be about 22 freezing tonight and these homeless really don't have nowhere to go you can see the apartments here they just can't afford rent here in las vegas we have inflation there's more homeless here it's just sad that we spent so much money overseas and it comes to help the american people not apartments right here inflation this economy has to get better it's homeless right in front of the apartments i did a video before look how many you have now okay this is the middle of the street right here there's the tents you got apartments coming up more apartments and just more homeless from the last time i did this video it's new year's eve the city officials senator the governor the President of the United States help these homeless. Thousands, you heard it, thousands of migrants are coming here in addition to the homeless. This is global, global. Now, billions of dollars, it's about money. Some would say it's about votes, but it's about money. This migrants, we have so many homeless people and now the, the, the migrants are coming here and they're gonna be homeless, a lot of them. Um, and on top of the American homeless, it's a global, it's about money. Um, and I talk to these people, most of them are from Venezuela. There's some from China, Africa. There's not just Mexico. They're coming through Mexico, right? But they're coming from China and like I said, Venezuela, uh, overseas, all over. And I'm out there with the homeless and we have and I read comments and some people are oh, just druggies and alcohol. No, not all of them. Some of them just can't. The economy, the inflation, and they're we, a paycheck away from being homeless, right? And it's just terrible. We go to the grocery store. But anyhow, migrants, thousands are coming over through everywhere. And it's it's global. And it's about money. And and, and uh, Greg, Greg Abbott is pushing them out of Texas. They're in Las Vegas. They're in Phoenix, they're in California, New York, and they're and they're and the homeless people, they're getting shifted away to worse spots. The migrants are taking over their little camps. It's a global problem. Global. And money and greed and political. And it has to stop. Because I predict, remember me saying this and subscribe and like and share this video. By March, everything hits the fan. It's going to get quadruple. It's going to be like on steroids. Um, and I don't mean them on steroids. Let's clear that out with YouTube. But it'll be crazy. And they, they need to close these borders. We need to work on something and stop this. It's worse than the mob, the Italian mob, 100%. Thank you for watching. What's going on over here? I'm going to give you some water and a banana. All right. What else you need? Here. Water and banana, you got some snacks? I'm going to bring you back some snacks. What do you want? You're going to be over here? Uh -huh. What did they do? What did they say over here for you? Uh, poop. Huh? They don't not they don't tell you you have to leave. You got everything all sorted out. So they're, you're good here. Uh -huh. 
What's the story? Why are we helping out all these other countries, not helping out the people, the homeless here? That's what huh? I assume. Right? Because tell the viewers. Tell, tell, tell them. They think everybody out here is on drugs or so. Tell the viewers what's going on here real quick. Well, they closed the shelter now. Right. They have charities. It looks like they got all the supplies down here. This is ridiculous. Help spend billions of dollars with a bee in other countries and hear nothing. Um, what, what kind of chips you want? Uh, whatever kind you got. I'm going to bring you a whole bag of chips. All right. All right. Hold on. We're going to bring her some chips. You hear what she just said? You heard what she just said? We're going to bring her a whole bag of chips. Let's see what we got.